it's National Children's Literature Week this week. So I decided I'm going to tell you my favorite books from my childhood. The first one is Where the Wild Things Are by Maurice Sendak. And this is a wonderful tale. And the illustrations alone are beautiful about the power of imagination. The next book is a book that I feel like most people have read. And it's The Giving Tree by Shel Silverstein. And it's about what loving unconditionally is. Another one, and I think there's several books, but it's the Madeline books by Lude Bil Bilsman. I'm not good with French, so I'm butchering that pronunciation. The next two books are Dr. Seuss books. The first is The Lorax, which is the ultimate um, environmental importance book, I think, and it just, it's wonderful. And the original animated movie is fantastic. The newer version is a little weird, but it was still lovely to watch. The next book is Green Eggs and Ham, also by Dr. Seuss, and this was the first book I ever read as a child. The next book is The Very Hungry Caterpillar. The art in this is wonderful, and it's just, I remember reading it multiple times. Chicka Chicka Boom Boom by Bill Martin Jr. is an alphabet tale, and it's I don't quite remember too much about it, but I remember really, really liking it when I was like first or second grade. The next one is a really sweet book and it's Love You Forever by Robert Munch, which is a tale of a mother and son and her love for him. The next one is one I'd consider a classic and it's The Little Engine That Could. And the last one is one that will make anybody cry and it's Charlotte's Web by E.B. White. And I've seen two different adaptations. I've seen the animated and I've seen the one with Dakota Fanning and both are great but it doesn't do the book justice and the way that the emotions are captured within the pages. Thanks for watching and I'll see you later.